The Sirkhive cluster near the Sion province was destroyed, but the Protoss forces paid a high price for their victory. Prior to Phoenix, hero and steward of the Templar was killed during the assault. Ah, The Conclave, convinced that its stratagems are winning the war against the Sirk, have let down their guard and turned their attention to personal matters. The Judicator Aldaris was ordered to find and arrest the wayward Tassad and bring him home to stand trial for his crimes of treason. Now, with only a small fleet for protection, Aldaris and the Executor have travelled to the Ashwald of Char, hoping that Tassada is still somewhere to be found. Hoo hoo. Executor, I know that you were reluctant to leave Iyer in this dark hour, and that you still grieve for the loss of your comrade, Phoenix. But remember that he lived and died as a Templar. He has reached the Kala's end. There is no greater glory than that. We Judicator are called to look beyond such matters, to ensure the safety and future of our people. It is not the Zerg, but the rogue Tassadar, who represents the greatest threat to us now. If he is allowed to spread the Dark Templar's tainted influence to Ayer, all will be lost. We will find him, and bring him to judgment. Tassadar claimed that this world was abandoned by the Zerg just prior to the invasion of Ayer. Yet I still sense a lingering darkness here. Be prepared for anything, Executor. If there are still Zerg on this world, then they must surely know of our arrival. Alrighty, we have to find Tassadar and bring him to justice. And we got a nice little space station here. Infested orbital platform on Char. Or above Char. Alright. So, this is like a kind of, um, you know, like an adventure mission style. As of like infiltration missions from uh, the Terran campaign. Uh oh. And some hydras. Now we have to uh, more or less conserve our units. Attack these hydras. Right. I do have a high Templar. He's going to be very useful with his storm, storm, psionic storm. That's right. As we use it on this group of circlings, they avoid it. Uh oh. Uh oh. Second colony there. It's a missing model Hydralisk. They're very common in this campaign. We've got a ramp here. Yep, let's go up here. See if we can find something useful. Wow, this is a nice little ramp. It's taking us all around the map. Okay, that's it. Yeah, that's it. Okay, this ramp wasn't very useful. Wow, what's this? It's a dude with a long tongue. Look at that. That's creepy. Okay, so we're going to have to uh, confront the sunken colony. Let's do it then. Nope, stay out of trouble. There we go. Right, trying to conserve my unit's health as much as I can. Because I don't know if I'm going to have reinforcements or not. Oh wow. Serblings. Oh crap, I'm so stupid. I put my own units in the Psionic Storm. That won't happen ever again. I lost a cell up there. Oh god. Got this ramp. I hope it's not another useless ramp though. Okay, it takes us over here. To another ramp. That takes us nowhere. 
Yeah, it takes us to another Zerg creep base there. Got some guys over here. This is nothing. I'm gonna go this way. Let's see what I find. Tassadar, where are you? Tassadar. More infested stuff. More burrowed circlings? No? Yes? No. Alright, let's go this way. Oh. Let's fight it out. Great. Okay, so we're gonna go this way. There's some muters. Well, a muter. One single muter. Easy to take out. Oh, Hydra, let's just take it out with our dragoons. And some circlings. Nice amount of them, actually. Okay, I don't really want to lose that dragoon. Almost, I almost lost the dragoon. Okay. Are you around here, Tassada? Tassada, mate. Where? Are you? Oh. Yep, there he is. Aldaris, Executor, how is it that you've come here? I was about to abandon all hope of rescue. I have come to arrest you and bring you home to Aya to stand trial. Arrest me? Aya burns at the touch of the Zerg. You travel all this way to arrest me? Don't let it get to you, man. This happened to me once. <laughs> That's Who is this human, Tassadar? The name's Jim Rayner, pal. And I won't be talked down to by anybody. Not even a Protoss. Amusing. Tassadar, your taste in companions grows ever more inexplicable. Executor, prepare to take Tassadar into custody. Executor, wait. I do not know what they have told you about me. But what I have done... I have done for Ire. Help me find Zeratul and his Dark Templar. They alone can defeat the Overmind Ceramids. Once we have won, I shall gladly submit myself to the judgment of the Conclave. Unthinkable. You presume that we would side with the Dark Ones as you have? You have gone quite mad, Tassadar. You shall speak of them with respect, Eldaris. Executor, there is much that I can explain to you. If only you'll help me find Zeratul. Yep. Basically, Tassadar is correct. We do need the Talk Templar. We've been surrounded. Okay. Get a cool, nice uh, amount of units here. Oh, and we got a base. Yep. Okay, let's build up. In fact, maybe I should make an Archon out of these guys as soon as I can. Archon, let's see what it says about the Archon. Born from the sacrifice of two High Templar, Archons are the embodiment of Protoss power. They protect themselves with powerful shields and fight by unleashing sonic blasts at the target and any enemy around it. Alright. Although, I mean, everybody knows what an Archon does, you know. They are power overwhelming. Oh, Tassadar is pretty cool. Got Sonic Storm, Hallucination, and he's got Feedback. That's great. And Rainer is just your plain old Rainer. He does have some Spider Mines, though. I should put some around... ...somewhere. Okay, here's a choke point that we can use. Let's put some Spider Mines here. Yeah. This should be good. Spider mines are nice. There we go. We are gonna leave Jim Rayner here at base. I mean, I don't want to risk him. It's too risky for Rayner. Let's get Gateway. Let's get a Cyber Core. Let's keep mining. 
I'll probably leave Tassadar at base as well. I don't want him dying. Although, maybe I'll risk it and just take him just because of the Tyranic Storm. He does have 50 energy more than a normal High Templar, so that's pretty good. Yeah. Alright. Okay, not bad. We are going to need a pylon over here because we don't have much much power over here. So we can build some photon cannons basically. There we go. Uh, let's get a couple of salads just to make a nice meat shield in front. Beefy meat shield. And get one of these upgrades, round weapons. Let's see what else we have. We've got Star Gates, Citadel of Dune, Temple Archives. Yeah, we want to make this, we want to make Archons. Or just make this our, 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 oh wow. Okay, spider mines. Nice. Good job. Let's, okay, we do need a Sith of Adun for that. So, we're going to place it over here. Soon we'll also make a, uh, some Dragoons. And maybe now. Yep, Dragoons. We're also gonna get Singularity Charge. Okay. We've already spent all the spider mines. I hear you. Yes, Executor. Go ahead, this is Jimmy. Yep. Will Tassadar and Rainer. How may I help? Of course. So our dune is up, we can get the leg enhancement or directly get the temple archives. I think I'm gonna go for the Temple Archives. Because I want to get that Archon. Archons are extremely, extremely powerful. Area damage and all. Very useful against Zerg units, of course. Just like. Um, okay, let's make the Archon there. Just like uh, Zerglings. Take out a bunch of Zerglings really fast. Marines, even. All right, we have power overwhelming. Let's see, save the phrase. Say it, say it, mate. There you go. I knew you had it in you to say it. Maybe we can make, yeah, we can make another Archon, maybe, yeah, have two on our team. They are pretty high on Vespine Gas, High Templars, though. That's fine. We can afford it. Come on, Vespine, there we go. Some uh, High Templars there. Actually, with all this, I just forgot. <laughs> I just forgot what the the new objective is, which is to bring Tassel and Rainer to the beacon, which is over here. So we have to go back to the beginning. I mean, if I backtrack, I suppose I shouldn't have any trouble getting there, right? Okay, let's merge these guys. Power overwhelming. Yeah, uh, spring. Okay, we've got an attack here. Alright. Easy peasy. Eleven squeezy. Dragoons going up. And uh, you know what? Let's move out. 
Let's just move on. I don't think this mission is that hard. I mean... It will be hard if I lose Jim Rayner, though. I have to be really careful. The thing is, Jim Rayner actually goes faster than all these units. So I have to be really careful with him. Okay, some missing Hydras. Missing model Hydras. Okay, we've got a bunch of overlords here. Let me take them out just for fun. That's what I'll do. Let's get the increased range for Dragoons. Okay, Muters. Take them out. We've got Sunken Colony here. Take it out as fast as we can. Queen, bye bye Queenie, and a bunch of Hydras. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, what am I doing? There we go. All right, we did it. Let's kill this last pair of muters, and we are done. Yay! You have my thanks, Executor. Now let us find Zeratul and speed our way home. Yeah, let's go find Zeratul. He knows things. Alright, that's the end of the mission. Now remember to leave a like on the video and subscribe to my channel. This is Tertio2002, signing out.